Hey guys, I'm back for another video, and this is my 100,000 video views special. And right now I'm at my spider trap, which is in progress at this point. And right now I'm going to present to you the YouTube starter kit, and I'm just putting the volume down because I'm getting hurt right now. And I'm probably going to die, but that is okay. <laughs> anyway... Um, so yeah, this kit basically consists of, oh crap, it consists of, oh yeah, I'm dead, um, <clears throat> two programs, Bandicam, the uh, newest version, the trial version, and PowerDirector Pro, these are the two programs I use to record my gameplay, and they're extremely useful, and you would think it's super easy to get all this stuff, but... In reality, it's actually kind of difficult. Oh yeah, you guys have not seen any of this yet. <laughs> Don't worry, episode 5 of the huge update will be up soon. Anyway, so, um, yeah. These programs took me literally like a year to finally find the ones that fit me best. For some people, maybe Fraps would be better for recording. But, let me tell you what my experiences are. So, <clears throat> Fraps... That's what I've been using up until about episode 100 of my Survival Island. And before that, I was using Fraps. But now I use Bandicam. And although the frame rate is a little bit more choppy with Bandicam, the file size is a lot smaller, the audio quality is excellent, and the video quality is about the same as Fraps. So for Fraps, <laughs> you've got really nice video quality just like Bandicam. The audio quality needs a bit of work, and the file size is gigantic. Not to mention the file splitting up and causing a lag spike, but I know the new version of the recording program prevents the lag spike, but still. Huge file sizes makes for uh, a not, not a very good idea to pre-record like 20 videos at once, because then your computer will crash because it'll have no space left on it. Well, anyway, so that's that. Now, PowerDirector is basically the cheaper version of Sony Vegas. So if you're going legit and you're actually buying these programs, then PowerDirector is the way to go. Because even though Sony Vegas is the best, it costs a ton of money. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it's like 500 bucks or more. I don't even know. So, yeah. So that's about it. So that's a short video. So... Make sure to leave a like, a rating, and subscribe for more. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.